Hey, what is up guys? Justin here from Out of the Basement. Today is Saturday, February 12th, and it is haircut day. As you can see, I've already trimmed up the beard a little bit, but now it's time to get this top chopped off. Today, it's nice early in the morning, and I'm feeling a hunt. I'm feeling a local hunt, but we might also venture out to other surrounding areas, mainly on the lookout for Black Series. If you've been following the streams, I've been telling the story of this, the Chronicles of Walmart and their backed up toy pallets. And Brickseek is saying that they have a regular wave in stock at my local Walmart, but I have been trying to find it for the past couple of weeks. Their toy stock is completely overstocked. There's like 15, 20 pallets in their gardening section. And I've just been striking out. So we're gonna go revisit Walmart today and see if we can find the Black Series case. And like I said, we might go around, you know, other surrounding areas. I'm feeling good. I'm just, I'm feeling a hunt. Something about getting a haircut just puts me in the mood for a hunt. Let's get it. Ooh, much better, guys. Much better. Let's get home, take care of the dog, grab Lucy, maybe grab an extra cup of coffee. I'm just feeling good on this Saturday. I'm getting some good juju. Let's get to it. First stop is Walmart, and all I'm seeing, little Tony Terra Ash. But they do have these Gremlins NECA packs. Nothing really new though, nothing really new. Okay, here in the toy section, I did see a little Power Rangers restock. Star Wars, same old stuff. Lonely Lando, three TVC Landos, but we actually do have some archive. Both are just Leia though. Moving into our DC stuff, been trying to find the Robert Pattinson Batman for our good buddy Brandon, but all they have here from the new film is the Riddler. A little bit more down here, but not what exactly what we're looking for. Over here in Marvel Legends, we do have one lonely shocker. That's cool to see. Same old G.I. Joe nonsense. As far as Lego Star Wars, the only new thing we have is the new microfighter. Nothing else out of the new stuff though. Over here in clearance, we do have some Shang-Chi. Lonely Doctor Strange from the Multiverse of Madness wave. Really random that this is right here. And a lonely little cap on clearance for full price. Oof. This is what I've been talking about right here. What a mess. Somewhere in here, there is a case of Black Series. Could be wave 30, could be wave 31, could be wave 32 for all I know. But according to Brixie, it's in here somewhere. And I've been trying for the past like three weeks as they've been slowly chipping away at it to try and find it, but no luck. I'm gonna try my luck today. There's just no way. There's just no way. Every time I see a Hasbro action figure box, I just get disappointed. And none of this is Black Series. Everything says Transformers, Power Rangers. How about you guys, see anything? Sometimes, you know, you just gotta get really, really deep in here, maybe poke around, poke around in some corners. I'm just not seeing it. It's impossible. Ooh. Oh. Oh my God, she's getting in there. She's getting in there. Anything? Goodness gracious. This just isn't possible. It's in here somewhere and that's what sucks about it. Yeah, no luck in the gardening section today, but they're slowly chipping away at it, so I have no doubt eventually I'll maybe find it. But yeah, check your gardening sections because toy overstock has been randomly in here. Maybe check yours. Okay, actually, I found a new spot where they are hoarding the toy pallets. Are you kidding me? I mean, what if I found a case that said Star Wars Black Series? I don't think it's up there, but Another little interesting, you know, toy pallet hoarding. I figured I'll pop into this GameStop real quick. All right, coming straight to the Star Wars section. We do have a wedge, helmet, bunch of gaming greats, jump troopers. Ah, they're peg warming, but at least they're stocked. Same with the flame trooper. Got two of those. Got the Zally boy. Up here we actually do have a turret from Rogue One. Very cool figure. Archive Luke. Retro stuff, TVC, that's about it. Okay, well, she did do that the first time we tried to figure her out. Yeah, we're just now going to 
So I usually don't go for bottom tier fast food, but this McDonald's over here got remodeled. And as you can see, it looks pretty fancy. Apparently they got rid of the play place and they added some sort of something, some kind of futuristic. Ooh, I'm down to check it out. Hey, hey. All right, slight change of plans. Lucy is gonna actually be hanging out with some friends, taking care of Kiwi, so that's nice. I'm finishing the hunt solo. The hunt must go on, so I'm flying solo right now. I actually decided to come to one of my favorite spots. It's about a half hour away from where I live. They have a couple Walmarts, a Target, stuff like that. Right now, just off the highway, we're gonna be going into a Walmart that you can't see because it's overexposed, but let's get to it. Let's see, we have tons more Lego here at this Walmart, but the only thing new is actually a few of these battle packs. Literally the same old stuff as the previous Walmart, except two Landos this time, and we still have our two Archive Leias. They do have this seemingly new wave of Power Rangers though. Joker. Some interesting clearance finds, $15 on the Fantastic Four stuff as well as 15 each for the Eternals Marvel Legends. Nothing I'm looking for though. Nothing in that Walmart. It's the same deal with the garden section. It's just full of overstock of toy pallets. The other day, Lucy did find me a 501st archive, so I did secure an additional. I know that doesn't count for today's vlog, but hey, you know, I'll take what I can get. Cool, our next stop is actually America's Antique Mall. It's just an antique store. I haven't been in here in a pretty long time, but last time I did, they did have Black Series, so let's check it out. Okay, we're in Best Buy, and look at this credit collection, and look at this one. And the Moff Gideon, what the heck? Is this like a variant? What is this? All right, guys, we just got done with the Antique Mall, Best Buy, 
disc replay and GameStop. For those of you that are curious, whenever there is blaring heavy copyright music playing in the store, that's why we don't do the narration and do our background music instead. There was a lot of copywritten music playing in those stores, so no narration, no narration for those. But now we're gonna be hitting up Target in this area. I'm really excited for it. There was a lot of cool stuff that I've seen today, but it's just, you know, heavy aftermarket prices and especially for army building that's just not for me i don't pay over retail for army building but i'm still holding that hope that we're gonna find something to actually purchase today let's do it Not good guys, not good. I already got my consolation prize at the ready, even though we have one more store to go to, which is Walmart. Holding out hope for Walmart. There probably won't be anything there. That's why I already treat myself. But you guys said you would still watch even if we don't find anything. You know, I guess it's comforting to know that none of us anywhere are finding anything. Let's go to Walmart. All right, final stop of the night, Walmart. Don't fail me now. As always, to Lando. We do have some of the Fantastic Four stuff. Got some Fat Thor on clearance for full price. All right, guys, you win some, you lose some. Unfortunately, in the wild, you end up losing most of the time, but I did see some great things. I still had a nice time on the hunt and in the wild today, especially at that antique mall. I saw a lot of rare, you know, exclusive stuff. Some 2020 Walmart exclusives were there. I would love to have a second, you know, Mall DeLorean Super Commando, but just not for, you know, $35, $40. I know that's sort of the aftermarket fair price, but not for me, especially for troop building. So it was still fun to see. I've been wanting to show you guys that antique mall for the longest time now. So you guys finally got to see it. And yeah, I mean, it's still a fun time going around and apparently you guys still enjoy even when we go out hunting and find absolutely nothing. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys have been finding out in the wild. Don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe if you are new. We are always talking about Star Wars The Black Series here on the channel. And if you are in a position to support the channel check out our channel membership the link to that is in the description below you get some cool custom emojis and a channel member badge next to your name much love to all of our members but if you can't that is totally okay too just like subscribe let me know what you're finding out in the wild i've been justin from out of the basement and we will see you guys next time